Nats and the Dodgers in D.C. with a win. The Nationals clinch a playoff spot, bottom of the third. Chris Capuano on the hill for L.A., facing Ryan Zimmerman. There's one to the gap in left center. Bryce Harper got a great jump, and he's going to score easily. The Nats lead one to nothing on Ryan Zimmerman's 86th RBI. And good base running by Harper, top of the fourth. Washington up 2-0. Ross Detweiler on the hill. Hadn't allowed a hit through the first three innings. But then Mark Ellis hitting this one into the bullpen. The solo homer, his seventh of the year, cuts the Nats lead to 2-1. to one. Bottom of the fourth, Denny Espinosa hitting it fair down the left field line. That's going to bring home Ian Desmond all the way from first. The RBI double makes a 3-1 Nats. Espinosa to third on the throwing error by Hanley Ramirez to the bottom of the fifth. Now a 4-1 game, Harper lining this one right at Capuano who makes the great grab. What reflexes by Capuano to the top of the sixth. Detweiler with two on two out facing Adrian Gonzalez gets him to ground out to first. LaRoche takes it to the bag himself to end the frame. Detweiler, six innings, three hits, one earned run, struck out five. To the top of the ninth, Drew Storm looking to close it out with the anticipation building in D.C. First batter he faces Matt Kemp. Strikes him out for out number one. The next batter, Gonzalez. Gone for out number two. And so with the Nats fans on their feet, the Dodgers' last hope is Ramirez. Nationals fans, the wait is over. Your team is in the playoffs. Well, I was told that in 2005, a year before I got here, that on opening night, grown men were walking into RFK Stadium with tears in their eyes at the return of baseball. I would assume there are a few here tonight now that this goal has been achieved. Nats win 4-1. It's the first postseason appearance in Nationals history. They become the first D.C.-based baseball team to play in the postseason since the Senators played in the World Series in 1933. They expand their lead over the Braves to five and a half games, and the magic number to clinch the NL East is now eight games. The Dodgers fall three games behind St. Louis for the second NL wildcard spot.